Hello everyone, here's Razi21. For today, I'm gonna make uh, the review of Showdown uh, uh, Journal Caesarana Showdown. Uh, there's the figures, but first, I'm gonna show the packaging. And you probably already seen these figures and the diorama on my display diorama Genosis. I have made it. So, um, here's the front of the packaging. It says Star Wars Legacy Collection 2 of 6, 2010 edition. Here shows a battle droid picture. And the other side, oops, the Rudian Jedi. I bought this, I guess it's a battle pack, because of this Rodian Jedi, and also because of this battle droid. This, I don't, I have only from the Clone Wars, but this is my first from the movie. But it's a good battle pack. Uh, down, he says also, uh, package fit together to from form around the background. Oops. Um, that's a good thing. Really good thing. You can make a really good display. He says, uh, shows the battle right in Rodin Jedi. So, uh, you're gonna read the description there. The Jedi uh, Knights rush to Genosis to rescue Obi Wan and he can pan me from the execution. The Jedi brandish their lightsabers against the Genosis warrior. Warriors and the, the massive army of battle droids, super battle droids and droid decas. Um, uh, all hope seems lost that any Jedi will survive this battle. Then you arrive with a, an army of clone troopers. Also, many Jedi's are lost that day. Others survived, survived this climatic battle that oozes in the Clone Wars. Um, I guess this description is on all six packs. Um, I I probably gonna buy the Shakti and no no sorry the Anakin Skywalker and Droid Decker. Uh, it's not because Anakin Skywalker. I really want to have a Droid Decker, but I must see if I can find this Droid Decker. I really want a Droid Decker. So he shows on the first. Collect all these ex exciting 2010 edition Star Wars Genosis Arena Showdown Battle Packs. It shows separately. 1 is Obi-Wan Kenobi and Super Battle Droid. 2 is Rodian Jedi and Battle Droid. 3 is Anakin Skywalker and Droid Decker. 4 is Shakti, Genos Genosian Warrior. 5 Nikana Stasu and Count Tuku. R and 6 R2D2 and C3PO with battle trade head. So, um, on a day where I went to my local Toys R Us and I only find this one and R2D2 and C3PO with uh, battle trade head. That was a shame because I really wanted to have a Troy uh but that's no problem. I really like this Rodin Jedi. You can if you want, you can put on cantina things, dioramas without his lightsaber. It's like a, it's a Rodian. You can put everywhere without his lightsaber. And if you take the head off of the Rodian Jedi, remember on the movie, I guess he's on the movie, when Jabba the Hutt is sitting and uh, a message came, your body hunt has arrived and you have like a table. You can put this head and make like a Greedo's head. That's a good touch also because you, without his body, you mo it's like a Greedo head. So I will try to put the head back. Uh, wait one second. There you go. Here's the Rodian Jedi. First, I'm gonna show first. So he have. A green lightsaber, as you already seen. Is a Rodian Jedi. Is no name. You can pu 
so you tell put a name on what you want um i must say uh almost everyone not everyone but almost uh, everyone likes the the strongest Jedi and the the best Jedi and whatever but my opinion is i really like the Jedi's like background Jedi's like this one or like Coleman Trevor it came on the 2008 or 2009 battle pack with Jango Fett. I missed that pack, oh my god. It was one of my favorite packs that I wanted to have, but I will try to see if I can find it. Uh, Coleman Trevor and Jango Fett. But uh, this was past. So yeah, I really like the background characters like Jedi's in Jedi's, of course. And as you all know this Jedi and like others don't have don't are strong like Obi Wan and all the others. My favorite Jedi is Kadi Mundi, as I already said on early videos. But this one is also a good figure and great character. Oh, not on the movie because you I guess you don't see it, but I really like this one. So I love to talk and. Let's go sh show the articulation. So, he have balling head, balling shoulders, balling elbows, super wrists, super torso, super hips, balling knees, and balling ankles. Um, great articulation for the this figure. I really like this figure. And is on the road in Jedi's. The fingers are bigger, but fortunately on this one the fingers are. All the same as all the other figures, but another color. And a nice touch is you can see on the camera, but on his fingers, as you can see, these holes. I know you can see, but he have all holes on his fingers. That's a good touch. And yeah, he have um, a belt. Uh, I is a brown belt. Brown belt and. Really nice touch on this head sculpt. Uh, I really like this Jedi. <laughs> so yeah, next up is Battle Droid. Uh, it's an, a normal Battle Droid. It's just a different color. Um, this is w my favorite Battle Droid. I have three. The others are from but uh, Clone Wars, but this one is my favorite because he have a lot of uh, articulation and. He stands well, but I have put this stand because I wanted to show you uh, when it's like on the first movie, like the the not Congress scam says, activate the droids. Is they are like stand plays like this, and the head goes on and sorry, I find. <laughs> Like this, and then activate the droids, and then he comes up. That's a good touch, really good touch on this articulations. So um, he have only uh, colors is red and a black eyes thing, and he comes with a blaster, droid blaster. That's it for a color, but. I must say this uh, this for this battle droid is really nice details on on him. I really like uh, the is not battle damage but the color. You almost say is battle damage. That's a good one, good touch. So I must tell the articulation. So you have uh, head can go on his torso and up, and he have bowling head. Uh, he have a small bone inch elbows, a swivel wrist or forearms, uh, no articulation on the torso like a swivel torso, but that's fine because he have a really good articulation on his legs. He have, um, we can say bone inch head, uh, hips. Swivel knees and uh, swivel ankles. That's a good articulation for this battle droid. Really like this one. So yeah, and I sorry. 
and it came with this pretty nice diorama background as you can see there are genesis for it uh, a dog genesis <laughs> and yeah i have only two genesis and it fits really nicely here if you can see it. one and the other one can display him the both like this but yeah <coughs> I hope you enjoyed this review uh, please subscribe comment I really love when the people comment to my videos <laughs> this is a touch that inspired me to make more reviews um, and subscribe to me as I already said don't forget to subscribe to my friend Patrick and GD uh, one four one zero 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 is below and all the the, um, the my great channels below don't forget to subscribe to them and thanks a lot for for the supporting and I have more than 152 subscribers I, I guess that's uh, just great I I love it so yeah thanks a lot for watching this review and my next review keep collecting bye